The COVID-19 pandemic has sent the value of many European companies plummeting, making them vulnerable to foreign takeovers. The EPP group has called for a temporary ban on takeovers by China to prevent that country from acquiring key European technology, infrastructure and expertise. The European Commission's new white paper on foreign takeovers is not enough. Quick action is needed to protect European companies. We as European People's Party, we are the party of competition, we are the party of open markets, of trade relationships. But uh, having today's uh, globalized economy in mind, we should not be naive. Uh, China is on a shopping tour in Europe. They are buying companies, our good companies, which are weakened after the corona crisis now. And that's why we need also a protection shield for the future that we can defend our economic interests. In the last years, Chinese companies had taken over about 360 European companies. Chinese companies have taken shares on uh, four airports, on six seaports and on wind parks in nine European countries. And it can become dangerous because of the question about technology, what, what will happen to our technology in China. We are in the corona shock situation where the European economy is heavily under pressure. So it's easy for Chinese investors to come to Europe and to buy our high technology uh, in the companies. Uh, that's why the White Book is welcomed, but the White Book is not enough. We need now regulation, we need legislation to protect our industry. When we speak about the modern technologies, then it's in the high interest of the Chinese to buy our companies and to get this expertise, to get this knowledge. And that is what we have to stop, because they are the future jobs and we have to protect them. If a company gets state aid, it is unfair competition. And um, so what we want is to protect our economy, not against competition, we want to protect our economy against unfair competition.